In just over a week, Pope Francis will arrive in the United States. He'll fly into Washington, D.C., go to New York City, and end his trip in Philadelphia with an open mass. It's a historical event, one that perhaps millions will attend, and in that sea of faithful will be a family of seven from Fort Wayne. Five kids and full of faith, the Reedy family about to embark on an odyssey in the odyssey that'll be the most memorable of their lives. You know, I had the idea and, and prayed about it and, and talked Becky into it. It wasn't quite that easy. I thought he was crazy because I initially just thought of our five kids. Ella, Jillian, Lucy, Bridget, and Henry, a handful at home. Hey! I thought, oh no, how can I handle them all the way to Philadelphia and throughout the week? A parent's first fear overcome by a call to grace. And then I decided, you know what? Lots of people are going to do it. We can do it too. And we will never have this opportunity again to share with our children, ever. And that's one of the things that really appealed to us is, you know, the popes don't come to the United States every year, every other year, or, you know, sometimes, sometimes it could be three or four times in a lifetime that a pope actually comes to the United States. So we wanted to take this opportunity, uh, knowing that he's coming, um, to go see him. Fifteen families, the official delegation of the diocese, felt the same way, all headed to Philly. But just a glance at the itinerary shows this is not about sightseeing. Starting Monday and every day during the week leading up to the Pope, they'll be taking part in the Family Congress with cardinals, bishops, theologians, knowing and growing their faith, showing their family the greater family of the Catholic Church. Uh, you know, our kids are being bombarded with... Um, Internet and TV and music, and uh, we want to take our kids out there to kind of get them, get the foundation for them to, to be ready to deal with that. It's going to be amazing just to be in the same vicinity as him. It's spreading the gospel. It's, uh, it's reaching out to the, to the far ends of the world to bring everybody in, and, and Pope Francis has really done an outstanding job of that, and I'm excited for him to bring that message to the U.S. The Pope arrives in the United States on Tuesday the 22nd and will leave the country five days later on Sunday the 27th. Still ahead tonight, a massive wildfire can